AZOT 2.0 is a tropic stack that recently hit the market. Now, the previous version set very great fundamentals for further improvement, but the question is, is this tropic stack better than the previous version? Well, let's find it out. Hey, what's up, Greg here, the founder of Your Inception. Welcome to my channel where you can learn top secrets about nootropics. Subscribe below to start your journey. So today we're gonna talk about AZ. Now, I received the previous version of this supplement about a year ago. I tried it out. I liked it a lot because, you know, it was very good stacked nootropic. Um, and, you know, I saw a lot of potentials there. But, you know, just recently I got the second version, which is slightly better. It has better ingredients and it is better dosed. The question is, is it as good as the previous version or is it even better? Well, check out my full review and at the end of this video, I'm gonna share with you if you should consider buying it or not. By the way, guys, are you currently taking any nootropics? If yes, let me know in the comment section below. So as I always do, I've done a proper, you know, one week test period of this nootropic stack. Um, you know, in this one you can find 60 capsules, so I figured out, okay, you need to take two capsules per day for the optimal dosage. Now, what I figured out during the test is you actually have to take two to four capsules and per day, of course. And, you know, as you can imagine, if you really want to get the optimal dosage of most ingredients, then you should go with four capsules per day. And, you know, that's what I've done. So first I did a, you know, I've been taking two capsules per day every single morning on an empty stomach. Um, and obviously nothing really happened during this uh, test period, at, at least at the beginning when I was taking two capsules per day. I was maybe slightly more um, relaxed, but it's really hard to say, you know. But then when I increased the dosage to four capsules per day, I felt better. I, I got a little bit more energy. I got a small energy boost. Um, I was more focused. Um, I generally felt better. I was in a better mood for most of the time. So. Yes, I was definitely able to see some benefits of taking this Entropic stack and I was pretty um, pleasantly surprised, let's say like this. Now, during my test uh, week, I didn't feel any uh, adverse side effects uh, besides one day, um, you know, I was, I got slightly sick. I didn't know why this happened, you know, it happened about, you know, 30 minutes after I took the capsules. Personally, I believe it, it has nothing to do with nootropics, uh, but you know, I don't know, I felt it once, so you know, it's something to consider. But in general, I mean, if you look at the formula, uh, if you look at the ingredients, you know, this formula is pretty clean. It has great uh, nootropics inside, so I believe this nootropic stack should be considered pretty safe and it shouldn't cause any side effects. I just mentioned ingredients. Now, keep in mind, this nootropic stack is produced in the United States um, it contains 60 capsules and it has some very amazing nootropics such as Alpha GPC, there's Bacopa Monieri, um, there is Huperzin A, and one very interesting nootropic which is called Teacrine. Now, Teacrine is not a normal stimulant, but it behaves like one, like coffee, like caffeine, of course. Um, now, the question is is Teacrine as effective as caffeine? Well, you know, this is something we're about to find out. So there's a lot of stuff I like about this Nootropic stack. It has high quality ingredients, they're well dosed, you know, the packaging is good, the customer support uh, is good, you know, so I see a lot of potential here. And also another benefit I see here of this Nootropic stack is that the guys actually developed the optimizer formula in just about a year, basically. And, um, you know, I really like to see companies you know, getting all the feedbacks and then optimizing the formulas, which is very rare in this Nootropic industry. Now, is there anything I don't like about AZ? Yeah, a couple of stuff I'd like to see improved. So first of all, personally, that's just me, I'd like to see caffeine inside. Now, I don't know if caffeine is more effective as teacrine, but you know, there's a lot of research uh, has been done on how effective caffeine is. I personally behave amazingly well when I take it. If I were able to, you know, change the formula, I would put caffeine in. Secondly, one thing I'm not so sure about this stack is you have to take four capsules every single day. Of course, there are nootropic stacks uh, on the market that, you know, require you to take six, eight capsules even per day. And, you know, four doesn't seem that bad, is it? But, you know, keep in mind, this is pretty inconvenient. So personally, I'd prefer if I can take, you know, a lower amount of, of capsules um, every single day. So three would be okay, two would be just perfect. So this is something I'd like to see improved in the future, if of course possible. And thirdly, keep in mind that, you know, 
um, if you have to take four capsules per day, then this means that you know 60 capsules you have in this package, they're not enough for the whole month. So then the product becomes slightly more expensive. You know, it's not a big deal, but you have to know about it. By the way, guys, I have revealed seven special secrets about nootropics that no one else will tell you about. If you want to get them, don't look my free handbook below. So the final question is, should you avoid this supplement? Should you consider it? Or should you simply go to the store and buy it? Now, in my opinion, you should consider it. It's a very good nootropic stack. It contains high quality ingredients. It is well dosed, which is pretty rare in this in the nootropic industry. And in general, my experience with this nootropic stack was pretty good. So you should definitely consider buying it. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, do let me know. Don't forget to follow Your Inception on Facebook and Instagram. And I hope to see you soon.